Hello everybody, uh, it's me, Sam here, and today we are going to do a tutorial on how to use and install Wormhole Extreme. Now, Wormhole Extreme is a Stargate Wormhole plugin for um, Minecraft uh, bucket. So, we're on the main thread and we're going to want to download the zip, I've already done so. We've got this up, now we want to go ahead and uh, move across lib and plugins into the main directory. Just merge anything and Wormhole Extreme Jar will be placed in there as well as a folder with all the settings. No it won't, that's because I created it. But start the server and then restart the server and then you should get uh, the files. So let's take a look at those now. We have the settings.txt these are all the default stuff, so the portal material you can use uh, if you're using economy, uh, if you're making a sound, all those things you can configure right there. Uh, you can add gate shapes here, and this is just the database of all the Wormhole Extreme uh, Wormholes. And for permissions, this plugin using permissions, um, the permission those are which are on the readme file but uh, wormhole you sign that's the user use sign gates uh, which I'll go over this tutorial uh, dialer lets them use a dial command and remove gates uh, your general general stuff just add them to whatever you think is necessary so that's all set up I'm gonna run the server and log in if all goes well, I should have made a plateau of of, uh, of clear stone. Yep, yeah, I have. Right. So, first of all, we're going to do the basic shape of the uh, Stargate. So, I obsidian minus one, just to give myself minus one. And you want to go ahead and do frill on the bottom. Now, I use dirt for anything else. So, do it like that, and like that. that. Just watch, just watch this bit, really. And how does it create one? And I'll give it a look of what it looks like at the end. You're meant to do that, by the way. So that's the general shape of the uh, wormhole. So you have three, one, three, one, three, one, three, one, in a general circle shape. Now, what we also want to create is a pillar. So this can be one in, and then a space of two, and then the pillar. So that can be there, uh, or here, and the alternative side. So I'm going to place a button on this pillar. Then hit the button. I'm going to type in wormhole complete, and then the name of the whole wormhole. So I'm going to use W1. This will create the wormhole. Um, if you fail to create it, it'll say you failed to create it. So we're going to want to uh, make another one of these. So for essence of time. Interesting. So there we are. Once we've done that, we can copy. Let me just do that instead. Oh my god, fails today. And we're going to type in paste. And there we have our new new whole wormhole. So you're going to give yourself another, another button. And place it down, and then this time when you do complete you're going to want to type in wormhole complete w2 and then idc equals and then the password you want for this so use pass just for easiness and 
and there we are, we created two wormholes, one wormhole without IDC, so one, this wormhole doesn't have a password and this one does, so you can toggle this on, provided you have the permissions to be able to use it or not. So, we've done it, now we need to uh, link them, so hit the button, and go type in dial, then the name of the other gate, so worm1. And it creates the wormhole. So we can jump through this and bang. Over here we go. Now, oops, I don't really like the wormhole material, so I can type in wormhole material. And then the type of material. So I'm going to use portal. And this will set the material of the wormholes to portal instead of water. Well, that's totally up to you. So that's the way of making general button ones. We can also make um, we can make uh, network ones using science if you can type in properly. So we created two of these. Now we want to do is add a new a bit to this on both of them and put a sign on them. Don't know why I give myself minus one. Now with these um what you want to do is the first line will be the name of your gate. So wormhole sign one. Alright. Now these can be used as networks, so if you put any text on the second line of the sign, it will be the network the gate is on. So, wormhole is the name of the gate. If I choose here, network 1, that will be the name of the network it's on, so network 1. If it has no network uh, there, it will be public. So, we're going to head and do WS1. I'm going to give myself another button and you're going to go, go ahead and right click that so uh, I've done that wrong because I already have a gate name of that so I'm typing wormhole sign one and there we are it's been created uh, there is another portal in this world which is WS1 but I'm not going to connect to that. Now you need to do this as well. So, one hole, sign two, smash it in. So now you can right click to choose the name of the portal you want to. So I want to choose that one over there, which is WSI1. Smash the button. Now you can see it's a portal now. Jump through, and bang, we're over here. Right, so, yeah. Thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe, this is me Sam Gabriel Gaming, signing out.